Nick here and welcome to another video from Wicked Wildlife. And uh, with me today we've got a coastal taipan. Now, this girl here is about the third most venomous snake in the world and probably the most notorious snake in Australia. And uh, just this week, unfortunately a bloke up in Cairns lost his life after having bitten by a coastal taipan. So, she's no joke. But I thought, seeing everything going on in the media about these guys, I'd like to take the chance to talk a little bit more about snake bite. In one of our last videos, we did discuss briefly snake bite in Australia, uh, how many people lose their lives, and we've compared this to countries around the world like India and Sri Lanka. But I wanted to talk today a little bit more about who the people are in Australia getting bitten. Do we have kids getting bitten? Is it mums or dads or this sort of thing? And uh, we're a little bit different to the rest of the world. The countries that we spoke about in our video um, such as India and Sri Lanka and New Guinea, uh, the vast majority of snake bite fatalities are generally women. Now the reason being is in these cultures, it's often the women who are collecting water and this involves them walking through the bush and uh, encountering these animals. However, we're a bit different here in Australia and I imagine through the rest of the first world. Uh, just today I'll flip through about 56 different newspaper articles I could find online of snake bites here in Australia and um, of those 56 41 of them were blokes on top of that 52 of them were over the age of 18 so whereas the rest of the world it's generally women getting bitten in Australia the vast majority of snake bite fatalities are adult men now we sort of want to wonder why this is it's not like men have to encounter them more than anybody else it's that women, you guys are smarter than blokes give you credit for. And uh, kids, you're smarter than mum and dad both give you credit for. I get asked at shows all the time, you know, are my kids going to want to go pick up snakes in the backyard after seeing this? And I always ask kids, what would you do if you see a snake in the backyard or at the park? And they, every single time, tell me, I'd call mum and dad, I wouldn't go near it. They understand it pretty well. Blokes, on the other hand, the best way I've ever heard it described was by a mate of mine up in Townsville. And he used to say, blokes are all cavemen, guys. 20,000 years ago, we used to wake up in our caves, we'd find a sharp stick, and we'd go and kill a saber-toothed tiger. We'd drag this thing home, and we'd be the king of the village. These days, most blokes go to Woolworths and we buy skinless chicken. And when we get the chance to hit something on the head, we jump at it, and, and sometimes we end up in emergency ward. So... The funny thing about this, or the unfortunate thing about this really, is most people who kill snakes, the reason they're doing it, if you ask them, they say, oh, I've got to protect my kids. But statistically, the most commonly per bitten person in Australia is kids' dads. Now, as far as how many bites happen to children versus how many bites happen to adult males, the real risk you're running is your kids growing up without a father. So, I always say guys, if you do find a snake, there is absolutely no reason not to call a catcher. These guys know what they're doing. Most of Australia has fair numbers of catchers on hand. And um, it saves you guys endangering your lives and, and potentially leaving your kids fatherless. So, please guys, if you do find a snake in your backyard, call a catcher. Call somebody who knows what they're doing. Because there is no reason for anybody in Australia to lose their life to a snake. Um, and there's no reason for anybody to ever have to lose a family member to a snake so like always guys uh, please subscribe to our youtube channel or well, check us out on facebook uh, our website is www.wickedwildlife.com uh, we're putting more videos up all the time we've got a, a few more in the pipeline already other than that please guys take care of snakes stick out of their way and they'll stay out of our way and like always have a good one